but welcome to our just pause practice. Find your grounded, safe space and know that you are safe. I'd like to do a metta meditation today for all that in the world who are suffering. Are you game for that? Okay. You are in a place where you can peel back the layers to access love and compassion. And it's that love and compassion that I'm going to ask, I'm going to invite you to share abundantly which means to the capacity that you have available. No more, no less. And in honoring that capacity within you, can you offer what you have in abundance to others? The metta, M-E-T-T-A practice. Translates from the Pali language to English as loving kindness. So, as we land into this moment, this safe space, physically, emotionally, and energetically, this calm abiding space where we can peel back the layers to clearer seeing, tap into your heart center, the balance of the lower and the upper chakras, the energy of love and compassion. And first, offer it to yourself. Now, you might be able to speak to yourself as yourself, or you might take a half step away and speak to yourself from your capital S self to your little s self. And whatever it might be that you want to wish to yourself, let that be the same wish that you would wish for others. And I've got some suggestions, but you're welcome to amend this meta phrasing as you would like. So. <sighs> Tappy. May I know peace. or of talking to yourself, may you know peace. May I know love. May I know safety. May you know safety. Add your own wish, your own blessing, your own intention, and offer it to yourself. Affirm you are worthy. You are enough. Now call to mind someone, something, somewhere that is easy to wish for, to love, to pray over to want the best for. Call upon that place, person, entity, experience and send them this same metta prayer. May you know peace.
May you know love. May you know safety. When we practice gratitude, when we practice compassion, it is a gift that is received simultaneously as it is given. So notice if in fact you feel a little more safe, a little more loved, a little more abundant in your offering. Because now I'd like you to invite into your energy space someone who you care for who is suffering. Be it dis-ease or disease. Be it relationship woes or mental health. Whatever it might be that they are in the active throes of suffering. Call them to your heart space, to your mind space and send them this metta. May you know peace. May you know love. May you know safety. Part of our practice, our responsibility and privilege as practitioners is to love regardless of the circumstances. Meaning there is no blaming the victim. Nor is there a withholding for those who are in a state of abundance for themselves. So now we call up someone that we know, someone that we love, who is in a state of achievement, a success, an abundance of (sighs) luck, love, joy, gratitude. And we send them these same energies, these same blessings and wishes. May you, in your joy, know peace. May you, in your joy, know love. May you, in your joy, know safety. Now gather your circle, those who are easy to love, those you love who are suffering, those who you love and are living their best. Gather them all. Each of these individuals you call to mind as the token representation of the broader scope of your circle. Those here in this day, those who have passed and even those yet to come. And let them bless you with these same gifts in order to build your reserves, in order to strengthen your sense of peace, love, and safety. Because you are going to need it as we go out to share. 
So hear from your circle. May you know peace in your suffering and in your joy. May you know love in your suffering and in your joy. May you know safety in your suffering and in your joy. Now, if you feel full, if you feel strong, then join me as I travel to global destinations to share these same blessings. If you do not feel strong, stay in your circle. Stay here in this moment in shared space. Be part of my circle as I take this energy out and forth. So let's first travel to Lewiston, Maine. Those who have been harmed, those who are still suffering, those who are in turmoil and distress because of the shooting this week. May you know peace. May you know love. May you know safety. Come back to your circle, be recharged, be renewed. The privilege of not being there does not free us from the responsibility of loving, of sending out, of doing goodness. But it also does not mean we sacrifice our own well-being. Our responsibility is to love ourselves and others. So again, check in, are you recharged? Can you now send that energy to those in the Gaza Strip, to the Israelis, to the Palestinians, to those who are stuck in the middle, to those who have died, to those who are have lost, to those who are unsafe. May you know peace. May you know love. May you know safety. And come back to your circle, come back to that sense of grounded, safe space. And then call up those who are tangled into the Ukrainian war, the Russian, the Ukrainian, those who have been displaced, and send them this loving kindness. May you know peace. May you know love. May you know safety. Come back to your safe, calm, abiding space, to your circle. See their faces, feel their affirmations and their love. And then again, if you can, there are countless places in the world that are suffering under dictatorship, under power, under threat global as well as individual, nations, first nations, as well as battling countries, but also individuals who maybe live in a home where there is violence, neglect, lack. 
let us send forth this intention to those who are open to receiving. May you know peace. May you know love. May you know safety. The work is not done, and yet the practice continues. The practice is the balance of our personal care, our personal practice, and holding our community in that same compassion. The responsibility, the accountability is love. Let's close this pause to resume our work. Bring your hands to your heart. Breathe in this same gift you have sent out to restore and renew yourself to begin again. May you breathe deeply, move freely, labor lovingly, and live vibrantly. May you know peace, love, safety. Namaste. Thank you.